Jennifer commented and asked this, I would really love a video that shows how to make freckles pop without having to burn each individual freckle. Being covered in freckles myself has made me learn how important it is to document every soul I steal. Guys, before we begin, I think today we have something to learn from Jennifer. Is that beauty is totally subjective. And beauty is not about having a particular kind of skin tone, particular kind of face, and particular kind of body shape. Beauty is about being original. Being what you are. So, it's for some people, they might not want their, uh, they might not want the mole to be there in the face. But for some others, it's a characteristic of their face and they want them to be accentuated. For some people, they might want to remove freckles, but for some, it's important. The way that Jennifer put it as the freckles documenting the souls she steals is really interesting. And today, we're gonna make, we're gonna learn how to make the freckles pop. So, this photo, by the way, is going to be available for you to download. Links in the description below. So I usually, when she, when I got the question from Jennifer, I tried a lot of ways using HueSatch. Okay, so in this tutorial, I'm not just going to show you how to do it because that would be just like two minutes, but I'm going to show you my complete approach so that you understand to do anything in Photoshop. I don't want you to learn a particular technique of how to enhance fre freckles or how to remove, uh, say, uh, reds of the face. I don't want you to learn that way, Photoshop that way. I want you to learn how to play by eye. Okay, so just today, just yesterday, maybe I did a tutorial about remo removing the reds. Uh, I think it was adding skin texture and that I talked about when you learn piano, don't learn the songs. Don't, no, no, that's not the right way. Instead, what you have to learn, you need to learn to play by ear so that no matter what song came on, you just bang it on the keys. So, so that's how you have to learn Photoshop. You don't have to learn how to do this, how to do that, how to do this technique, that technique. No, th you, that's a part of learning. But yes, you have to learn to understand things right from the grassroots so that no matter what technique is thrown to you, what challenges, whatever comes to your mind, you're able to put it right there in uh, your computer. <laughs> All right. So let's go ahead and straight away, let's enhance the freckles. So first what I did, I thought, okay, how to if you want to enhance the freckles, you have to differentiate it. You have to make a selection of it in any way possible. So I thought, of, okay, there's a way in hue saturation or select color range, I can do that way. So I went to hue saturation um, and then I tried you just picking out this color of the freckle, something like that. And I tried changing it, but it didn't quite happen. I tried playing with this. I didn't quite happen because what was happening was the freckles of here match the skin tones of this place. So it's kind of not happening. So uh, this totally knocks off select color range out of the equation. So I tried select color range, but that also didn't help. So let's try selecting this area, freckles. It's not helping, right? It's totally not helping at all. It's selecting a whole lot of other areas as well. So the next thing that came to my mind, all right, let's go ahead and delete this. The next thing that came to my mind, okay, think of freckles as a texture. Now, what is the filter that accentuates particular texture selectively? So high pass filter came to my mind. So that might be a good filter to do. So let's make a copy of this layer and let's apply high pass filter other high pass now i let's see how it comes up to be now let's play with the values just a little bit and good good and stop at the point where it enhances the freckles just the freckles see it has to begin begun to enhance the freckles now let's increase it just a little bit now watch the freckles are being enhanced have a look now this is too much, this is going beyond. Let's bring it down a little bit, bring it down a notch. And this is too less, I guess. I think 16 would be a nice number to be in. Let's try 15. I don't know why I always try round figures, but uh, that's kind of the way that it feels good to me. Okay, 15.3, pretty much okay, let's okay. Now we need to find a way to darken it. So now it's applying the filter, it's gonna take time. Now, let's go ahead and change the blend mode to overlay. 
Now watch, the freckles have been pronounced. But here's another thing. The thing is that the whole image has been affected. Now you know what to do, right? So create a mask, press an old alter option and click on this button. And then take a brush, make sure the foreground color is white, it's gray, so press D to reset that. And then just simply with a flow, solo, like 20, just paint over the freckles. Have a look. Now this makes freckles pop. Before, after, if you want to enhance the effect, paint even more, right? So that's how you do it, by the way. Guys, um, if you want to download the photo, you can. Links in the description. And if you have the Pexels Photoshop plugin, please download the Pexels Photoshop plugin. It helps a lot in searching for free stock photos. All right, so I think we are done here. And that's how you do it. Okay, if you find another way to do this, let me know. So in Photoshop is such a software which can give you a million ways to do a particular thing. So it's no surprise if you find another way, I would be glad to know that. So thanks for asking the question, Jennifer. See you again in my next video or live stream. Thanks a lot for watching. Till then, stay tuned and make sure that you keep creating and take care. Keep practicing, happy photoshopping, and keep trying new techniques. Play with Photoshop. Don't just go key by key. Just play. Right? Have fun. But hey, man, I'm feeling pretty good today. Real life, not everyone got parents to love them. Not everyone got a shoulder to lean on when they're struggling. We ain't all got people to hug us. So even get told enough that we're important and worthwhile, but it don't mean we aren't. Trust me, I know the story, cause I have the story in me to tell you that he must never communicate to you or whether you're of love, you're worthy of kindness and the patience you would dream that is what's chasing.